Hey guys, what is going on? Welcome back to Fisherman Norby. Out here today at a pond we fished in the last video. Uh, it's the second time ever fishing this pond. We just got on them so good we had to come back. So I'm back out here with Brandon today. Uh, I'm walking to the spot to fish. I don't know if you guys can see all these cattail stems in the ice, but it is just such good cover for these fish to hide all year round. And uh, we're fishing the edge of the cattails today. That's kind of where we ended up finding them in the last video. Brandon's got the drill here. We're gonna drill all around, see if we can find where these fish are, set the hut up, try to catch some crappie, bluegill, maybe some bass. Let's go. Okay guys, we just got the first two holes drilled here. Brandon's got his rod set up. He's over there trying in the cattails. I'm gonna sit down here, try these holes kind of by where we caught them last time, and hopefully we'll get on them again. And I'm using the same bait. It's a little ice jig, it's pink and white. It's got a tight lines UV ice plastic on it that's clear and purple because this pond's got pretty clear water. And I'm gonna use this little waxy and I'm gonna stick it down the hole here, see if we can get some. I haven't gotten any bites yet. Brandon drilled a hole over here in the cattails and he's caught three bluegill right in a row. Nice, man. Right on the edge of the cattails, huh? Yep. Right the edge there you go. About four foot. Yeah? Some bluegills munching it, huh? Yep. Nice. Good job. <laughs> Get another one. I will. I'm going to keep going back over there and try for some crappie, all right? Okay. You got another one? Yeah. Man, Brandon's really catching them in the cattails over there. There we go, got one. Whoo, crappie, all right. That's what we're after. Brandon's over there catching bluegill in the cattails. He says he's caught six over there. And I uh, came back to where we started last time we were at this pond. Caught this one suspended in about six foot of water and it's 12 foot deep here. So we're gonna drop back down, see if we can catch another one real quick. There we go, guys. Oh, it's a bluegill. <laughs> all right, well, if all I'm gonna catch is bluegill here, I might as well go fish where Brandon's at. He's catching one every second. Oh, I just got bit. There's one, another one. Oh, it's a crappie. Oh, he got away. Dang, I might have to stay here now. Crappie are biting. Got another one. All right, guys, Brandon is on them. So uh, we're gonna go over there and catch some bluegill. Crappie just aren't biting in these holes today, but that's okay. I think you got one. Yeah, I think I need to be. Yep, you're right. Well, right there. <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> yep, he was right there. I think I muddied my hole up too much. I'm not even oh, you'll be all right. getting a bite. Man. What the heck? You got the secret hole over there. We're dropping you down the same hole. So yeah. <laughs> I'm like two feet away from you. But when I drilled this hole, I got muddied up uh, from uh, some sort of weed. There, look at that. Yep. That's crazy. They're not in my hole at all. I'm like four feet from you. What the heck? Isn't that crazy? It is. I'm gonna dry dropping down without a waxy and just a Tylon's UV it. ice plastic, see what happens. Sure enough, there we go. I didn't even need a waxy. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> wow. That's so cool. Oh, just a little tight lines UV ice plastic. No, no waxy. Right, now that's on them. <laughs> yeah, we'll just take turns. Yeah. You catch one fish, I'll catch one fish. <laughs> yep. That's hilarious. <laughs> wow. We're fishing out of the same hole. <laughs> We're both fishing out of a five inch hole. Wow. There he is. Three foot. All right, your turn. Okay. We don't got time to drill another hole. 
There's too many fish. <laughs> right. This is crazy. There's All like right, 20 bluegill down. there. I'm gonna drop down on this edge. All right. Hole. I'm gonna try dropping down in my hole now All that right. the water's cleared up a little yeah, bit. Oh, I think I did get a bite. <laughs> there he is. All right. Yeah, that's a nice big bluegill. I bet the water cleared out in my hole. Bit. Yeah, that's a <laughs> beautiful one right there. Four foot away. Look at that, guys. <laughs> Why would that be a difference? Beautiful. <laughs> there we go. Another one. All right. Now I got some confidence in my hole. Yeah. There's one. Back to back. Oh, that's a pretty they gill. Bit. They're got, they're Look at that, guys. These Beautiful on the little jig with Thailand GB ice plastic. <laughs> Alright guys, well we we got about 20 bluegill on the ground already. Most of those were Brandon. <laughs> uh, but I, I came over here last minute and caught a few with him. Brandon, I'm gonna go back to the crappie hill. Okay. You gonna stay here? Yep, stay here. Alright, I'll leave this camera on you and okay. uh, we'll see if you catch a bunch. Okay. I'll see. If I don't, I'll be over with you. <laughs> I'm sure you will. <laughs> so I'm gonna leave that on you and I'll, I'll go see if I can find a few more crappie now. I come over here and your pole's got a fish on it. <laughs> the one we left in the water. Right, you pull it in. <laughs> yeah. Just a little bluegill. Yeah. Wonder how long he's been on there. Wow, that's funny. Okay guys, there's two holes here, so I'm gonna rig up a spoon uh, for a second rod and I'm gonna drop it down one of these holes and I'm gonna fish my jig in the other hole. See if we can catch a few crappie here before dark. Oh, hooked up on the spoon over here. Oh yeah, crappie. Yeah, maybe the crappie want the spoon. A little more minnow life like looking bait. Sweet. Go back down. I'm using a Swedish pimple, and uh, yeah, these are really good spoons. There we go. Hooked up on the jig. Another crappie. Yeah. You catch any more gills? Couple? Yep. There we go, guys. Beautiful crappie. That's like the perfect eating size right there. Got my fish pile starting to happen over here at these holes now. If you want to throw the crappie or the bluegill in here, <laughs> and then you can get that on camera too. Okay. It'll look kind of cool. <laughs> I caught one on the spoon and one on the jig. Yep. Yeah. So I'm gonna go back to just the jig. Okay, guys. Brandon's bluegill kind of shut off over there. We caught about 20 shallow. He's gonna come over here now. After I caught these couple crappie, we're gonna try to get some more of these. Whew. It's cold tonight, guys. It's just getting dark on us. Uh, Brandon caught way more fish than I did tonight. He found the bluegill. Uh, he caught one crappie out of the bluegill holes just a little bit ago, but I caught a few crappie out of the holes we fished last time and a few bluegill, and I caught a few bluegill over by him, but it's just been kind of a tough night. Uh, they're being a little finicky, super windy, uh, but they've been hanging in these cattails that uh, I, I walked you guys through. It's only three to four foot deep where we're catching all these fish in the cattails. Kind of crazy, but it was a fun night. We caught a lot of fish, and I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you haven't entered the giveaway for some of those Tightline UV ice plastics, go to my last video, enter to win. We'll be giving those away here soon. Oh, Brandon's hooked up. Let's go check it out.
Nice. There you go. One. He's a fish. You just won't quit catching them tonight. Yeah. Oh, not yet. <laughs> There's the, the crappie and gill he caught here just a couple minutes ago. You're smoking them, man. Yeah, smoking them. We had a really fun night, but we're going to get out of here. It's getting dark on us. We'll catch you guys next time on Fishing with Norby.